I have very nice things in, in my mind, but I need to talk to the Ministry of Culture for that. <laughs> and I literally, need, in, for my idea that I have in my mind, I need to send a letter to the Ministry, ministry of Culture of Greece. Or evening, what is up? My name is Marte, that is Ilona and Jason. Welcome to the vlog. Welcome to the one take Sunday of today. We're starting the one take Sunday on Sunday at 5 34. Just so you know, we always take about 10 minutes from our lives, something like that. Literally, today I took literally, we're literally gonna take 10 minutes of our lives and we're just gonna non stop one take through this because we have not done anything today. We watched a movie, yes. Uh, we, by the way, have been watching a couple of movies because this mister likes to sleep now for one and a half hours sometimes. So, yes, mister, then we decide to take a little break and watch a movie. You mind? I don't think you mind at all. You have teeth, show them your teeth. He's teething so so bad, I won't say, show, but show, so show, good. Show, show. He's teething so good, actually. Show it, show it. They're not going through really yet, but... Are they? Uh, yeah. I'm not sure. I do see your little zit on your chin, though. <laughs> Hi. But thanks to him, we can watch some movies again, right? Mm -hmm. Or actually, thanks to my sister, because we have Netflix, thanks to my sister. <laughs> I have just, uh, or I, I, I don't want to take all the fame and everything right now. Uh, Ilona just uh, boiled the pasta, baked the mushrooms, and then I went to the supermarket to get some tomatoes and put that all together into some very nice and tasty food, by the way. I know. I know that I said we're gonna do some food vlogs and um, also some cooking. I promised Blazing's actually already for a year right now that I'm going to do some cooking vlogs. Yes, I want to do some cooking vlogs, but I want to do it professionally with a nice view, you know, nice and outside, for example, just like the video of Tech It Series. What? I just bumped my hand into my bottle. You bumped your head into your, your head or your hand? Your head into your bottle. How did, wait. We interrupt this uh, situation for what? How do you bump your head into a bottle? Mm, you're too cute sometimes, Mister. Hi. Say hi to the camera. Say hi to the camera. You don't need to grab it, but you can just say hi to the camera. Look at these legs. <laughs> hey, pure excitement. Well, you can pure th excitement. you can throw a ball against his legs and he will play football immediately. He kicks it away very far. <laughs> we cannot use this anymore because we're too big. Yeah, we're too big for the legs. Anyway, long story short, what I want to say, because otherwise we never get to that one story. Oh, you were saying a story. I was saying a story. Yeah, I actually take a seat or uh, lay down like we've been chilling. I have been chilling most of the time. Miloda needs to feed him also. What? I know, I made a mess on the couch, but that's the corner because Jason is sitting in the corner, so we collect all the pillows together. There's toys laying on the couch. There's Richtari because I was nice and cool during the film and I just sit like this. What? It was nicely folded. It was not nicely folded. No, because I took it out of the laundry and immediately went on the couch just like... <laughs> I blame you. I want to do cooking uh, like Tech It Series did, not exactly, of course, because they had a master chef. That, uh, what's his, the uh, this? what's his first name again? I forgot your first name, whoops. I don't like it when I forget names. Nah, never mind. No. No, something Diamantidis. I know, anyway. I want to do a video like that. For the ones who do not know actually what that is, so I have something in my teeth, can I get it out? I should not do that on film. Uh, <laughs> for the ones who do not know that, it is uh, it, MasterChef, most people know actually, it's a TV show. And uh, one of the winners, I think he was, yeah, he was the winner, was uh, a young boy from Volos, uh, Diamantidis. And uh, when he won, he started doing some online videos actually, I'll put the links up here. To his videos on YouTube. Our son makes a lot of noise, just like me. Yeah. <laughs> he's, he's completely like that. But they did it together with Tech It Serious, and the videos turned out very nicely. Nicely outside and cooking, easy, simple dishes. Super tasty, but 
usually like in one pan or something and that's what I promised Blazing Salsa to do a one pan cooking thing so you can make a risotto in one pan for example you know dude you're really complaining aren't you we are you also going to change your diaper yeah, I'm going to change my diaper. okay because you said we are going to change our diaper I don't don't call me Malaka. Okay, Malaka, bye. I love you too. Mm -hmm. Bye. 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 Anyway. It is bedtime, people. You can hear me in the background. Sorry for the shakiness, by the way. One take Sunday. Literally last time from the one takes one take Sunday, it wasn't one take. But I did cut into it because I was talking way too much, just like now pretty much. I can also see very nicely the, the time of course on TV and I see it here on the screen as well and I'm already 5 minutes and almost 40 seconds in. Uh, yeah, but that's, that's a nice idea. I want to know your opinion about this channel because uh, I got some, I get very nice uh, comments in general. I love your comments. I love when your people inform me. I know there are some people that say like, I don't want to be the one that is writing this again. And I know you know who you are, but we sincerely love to read your comments. And, and it's not necessary to delete them because we already see it in our email that you wrote an email, that you wrote a message. So we love when people actually are informative in the comments. What I do not love is racism in the comments. So if everybody can say whatever they want. Freedom of speech is still, is still a big thing in my heart that I carry close to me. You can say whatever you want about any, anybody, but racism is wrong. That's just not done. So that's also what I don't allow. Anyway, long story short, that was, that was not my point. <sighs> Making myself tired. My point was I wanted to know from you guys what you actually want to see. So I did one gaming video. I did in the past somewhere a Fortnite kind of video. Did not want to do Fortnite anymore. Fortnite that that like thing that I just it's still super trending, but I don't like Fortnite as a game. I played it a little bit with Blazing's also. It was kind of cool. Um, now I do think that I might upload another Anthem video, but I want to know your honest opinion because the video was watched very badly. Um, I like the gaming, but I just can take like a little hour instead of watching a movie, for example, I can play a game, for example, you know, I don't know. Um, in my mind, I need to send a letter to the Ministry of Culture of Greece to, uh, I'm just, I'm, huh? To ask for a license, yeah, Elon says ask for permission. I want to do uh, magnet fishing. Magnet fishing is literally take a magnet, hang off a rope or uh, into a bridge or put it on a pole and go into a river or something and start like fishing for magnetic stuff like metals, coins, uh, can be anything. And then I will donate it to the museum or if the Ministry of Culture lets me do that, I can, I don't know, sell it or something. I don't know. It's something in my mind, metal detecting and stuff. I just love it. I want to do it very badly. I think it's very interesting for the vlogs because it's we go places, we'll, we'll learn about the history. I have a friend who is a great archaeologist. He's still studying. Yanis Kaitana, I know that you're looking someone, but he, he's a super cool guy as well. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm thinking about. Anyway, if you have other ideas for this channel that I can do, like silent vlogs that I also still have ready. I have literally have footage ready to, to do that. I'm gonna put you guys down here for a second. If you think that uh, there is something that you want to see on the channel that you want to see me and Ilona do, because there's a lot of things that I can do on my own, like the metal detecting and all that kind of stuff, I can do on my own. What did you say? Yeah. But I want to do something together with Ilona also, and that's Something that is difficult, of course, with Jason, but I really want to do stuff and go out now that we still have the time that Delona doesn't need to work also, you know? I know you want to just see our daily lives, and at this moment, that is this, but, uh... Oh, we're naked? Very naked. We're very naked. Well, I'm not, but he is. Let's, let's do this quick. Hello. Hi. How are you doing, naked boy? Wiggling, eh? Yeah. It is so difficult to change his diaper now because it's literally like changing a sumo wrestler. He's wriggling all over the place. Anyway, so what I want to say also about the metal detecting is that I, it's something that I didn't know, but Greece is very strict on those laws. In the Netherlands, you just can't get a metal detector, go into a field, so you have to talk to the owner of the field, of course, and start collecting stuff, actually. You can search as much as you want. If you find a coin, you can keep it, finders keepers. 
In Greece, if you actually get caught at the border with a metal detecting device, it can be confiscated. And if you are, be are you, if you're found somewhere on a beach, for example, metal detecting, you can get a prison sentence of 10 to 20 years because Greeks are very strict with their cultural uh, heritage. So yeah, something new. 544, 10 minutes out of our lives, one take Sunday. Uh, Ilona, did you want to say anything else to the people that are watching? Anything else to the people that are watching? Yeah. Do you want to say, do you think that they had come, can come up with a, a good, nice idea? Uh, how to change diapers. How to change diapers for a very wiggly baby. Mm. Yeah? Yes. I turned him, him from uh, his belly already for four or five times. Yeah. It's uh, by the way, if you say I think in the background sometimes like what a mess did they have in the house? We're going to now as soon we have a lot of stuff that we have collected that does not fit on Jason anymore because he's growing very fast. For example, the relaxer that's standing down down there, we could have put it like up in we don't have a lot of saving space in this house. Let's put it like that. I'm always finding excuses for stuff, but sorry, at this moment it's a little bit hectic. And we're cleaning up. So before you clean up, you make a big mess. Lots of stuff coming on tomorrow, normal, regular vlog. Thanks for watching this uh, One Take Sunday. If you liked it, don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. Leave a comment down below because we love to read them. We always reply. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next one. Bye.